Hi guy, time to look at a Super Nintendo game known as Desert Strike. Uh, now I know I'm doing this series completely out of order, but I will admit I didn't even know uh, I owned this one on, on the SNES. Uh, I've got um, the sequel, Jungle Strike, on the Mega Drive. I'll do a video of that uh, probably in the next day or so. And if so, of course, you've seen Urban Strike and uh, Soviet Strike in the past. So yeah, let's fire it up and see what it's like. A for options, buttons. So Y is guns, B hydras, A missiles. See, nice and easy. Uh, da -da, campaign one. Let's go. Du, 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 du. More wonderful story. I think the, the first one is uh, <clears throat> based more on humour. It's more like a, a, a joke laugh at uh, Saddam Hussein back during the Gulf War. Here we go. Let's just put a bit of volume on that. There is some volume to it at least. Not like with uh, Urban Strike. So we say. Well, I can't fire yet because I'm still close to the ship, that's it. I had this back on the Amiga, absolutely classic game. Whoa. Whoa. Let's see where we're going. Oh, left a bit. <laughs> left a bit, right a bit, up, up, up. And straight in. It's much more metallic sound to the gun this time. Ah, so you can't fire your missiles and your gun at the same time, sadly. Whoa, no, no, don't hit them, those are bloody bullets. Alright, I'm lost again. I'm going the wrong way, that's why. Now, I don't think on this one you actually get a chance to uh, change vehicles. But at least the hydrogen missiles take something out straight away. And it seems to aim it a lot better as well. I don't know where I'm going now. Keep going up. Nice and simplistic. I don't know if you notice the menus there, but. Uh... There we go, lad. Up on board! We've saved somebody. What a hero. Mission 1 completed. Straight into it. Bloody hell, I've not played this for years as well. Right, power station, nice and easy. Danger zone, you're not kidding, bloody hell. Airport. Whoa! One in low armor. I'm down, I'm down, and I'm dead. Oh. Whoa, it's taking a few bullets there, but it's gone. It's a pretty fun game, this. Whoa, I'm out of bloody hydras, that's why. <laughs> Watch out. Oh, I've destroyed the bloody fuel drums. That's it, isn't it? That's the power station. And another. Oh, what's that? Bullets. The only problem I have with this one is it seems to push your helicopter way over to the uh, top corner of the machine. Sorry, top corners of the screens are top left and right. Let's see where we have to go now. Nice and easy. Oh, he's making a run for it. No, you don't, sunshine. Well, I'm, I'm there, aren't I? Just don't have to destroy. Who cares? Destroy anything. This is going to take a while with the bloody bullets. Oh man, I'm going to be this, at this all day. Whoa, he's got a bloody missile rocket with a launcher. There we go, nice and easy, one plane at a time. I'm not going to be no crazy Arabs coming after me this time. I 
I assume you're just supposed to destroy all the planes. I mean, that takes out a big chunk of the runway as well. There we go, it's down. Warning, low fuel. We better go and have a look then. Landing zone, ammo crates, fuel drums. Just one down a bit. I know, I know, lad, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Where's that bloody fuel? I passed it, I passed it. Come on, don't crash and burn. It's in there. This is going to take forever. <laughs> I think the third game was a lot kinder when it came to uh, dishing out the goods. <laughs> and he's down. No, it, does, it refuels me, blows me up. Well, it doesn't give me any weapons. Oh my god, come on. Oh. Is it down? Is it down? It's down. And there's no more planes. Terrorists. Oh, keep flying. I need to find some bloody ammo, don't I? MIAs, triple A's, not sure what that is. VDA, I don't know. So I could really own this. Fuel drums, ammo crates. I'm not going all the way back to the ship, because I bet that'll let uh, refueling and stuff, but it bloody annoying. Whoa, that one moves. You see what I mean? I'm going at full throttle there and it almost pushes the uh, helicopter off screen. Come on, ammo please. No, not a rocket launcher. More terrorists down. How oh, ammo have I got left in that? Fuel lines. Oh, I don't think you're limited, are you? It's just the missiles that go through the ammo crates. Fire away. Oh, I've got to say, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun, but um, obviously, being the first one, it's more simplistic than the other, other two games. But I'm definitely going to give it it's a 4 out of 5 game easily. Possibly a 5 out of 5, but I've not played it in a good few years. And when I did last play, I think it was on the Amiga. Come on. <laughs> I was hitting the wrong spot, bloody hell. And there was nothing in there. Christ almighty. And again. Keep on going round and round and round till something blows up. And still no ammo. Why shorten the map if there is none? I'm determined to get something out of these bloody huts. <laughs> That's it. And there we go. Wee! Off to finish the airport. He nailed me. Is that it? Three lives and we're dead? I'm dead and I'm down. What what a terrible way to finish the video, but <laughs> Oh yeah, it's a pretty good game, but if you're willing to put some time into that, you know, uh, I believe it does branch out into uh, different sections of the world. Yeah, overall guys, highly recommended and as always, I will uh, do my best to post another video soon, so thanks for watching.